Back by popular demand? Maybe not. Um, okay, so today we have a Gucci, what would you call it? Side bag? S side bag. Let's get down with the kids. Okay. If you were born anytime in the 80s, I think you'd probably call it a bum bag, maybe. No? Yeah, bum bag. Okay, so there we go. Waist bag, waist bag. A waist bag, a bag along your waist, whether yeah. it's front or back. I was like, I was saying waist bag, but no, waist, no, waist bag. Waist bag. It's, it's not a terrible bag. Okay, so there we go. It's Supreme Print. Um, it's leather edged. It's zipped. Um, I'll show you the inside in a moment. It's so practical. Why? It's zipped. It's zipped. So it, it does have, um, this is a canvas strap, which is real heavy duty. Webbed, but, they but call the, it webbed. Webbed. But this is um, met the clasp and the uh, adjuster, I guess, is, is metal. For some reason, I don't know why, I'm showing the wrong bit now, that piece isn't, it's plastic. I don't know why that is. Mine's kind of that, random. My, on my Prada day, it's the same. same. Okay, I'm guessing because of wear and tear, maybe yeah, scratching it, or whatever. Yeah, uh, no, because you also, because you push, sorry guys, you push in, yes, it's in a quicker release. Because it's plastic and it's, yeah. I guess, more. Okay, cool. Just a quiet conversation there. All that, all that other piece of leather, both ends. Um, what type of leather? I've had this. I'm going to be his worst critic. Yeah, uh, pebbled. Pebbled. Regular pebbled leather. Tumbled, if you want to be really specific. Um, the bag itself, I've used it once or twice mm -hmm. since I've had it. Um, it I would say the adjustment is kind of, I'm like a 36, 38 maybe waist. Uh, it goes around my waist, that kind of happily. There's not much more adjusting there. So if you, if you, if you does anything go around your waist happily? Not anymore, I'm afraid. No, guys, it does not. Um, but that's kind of mean as well. Uh, um, so inside, is canvas lined. Um, it has a small pocket here. Obviously, we have the Gucci. Um, what do you want to call them? It's not authenticity card. It's what is it? Care, Care card. card, yeah. And then inside. It's just one pocket, as I said, nothing on the reverse canvas line, as I just said. Um, it's a good, it's a good kind of, um, I guess, I wouldn't say everyday bag, because it's, it's kind of the way you'd wear it, unless you're going to kind of hold it, or like, you're not necessarily going to wear it like that every day. You could put a crossbody. As I say, for me, probably not. Uh, I could, but it'll kind of be Mate, A lot here. of people do, though. Your, your, yeah. um... Broad? Should we broad, say broad? broad? Let's go broad. broad. Um, I'm okay with that. Um, but I think... This was, what, what, did, what did this cost? Retail. 280. 280. And this one? Uh, from Vista. And this was from Vista Outlet. Um, this is actually, um, I've seen it in full price, yeah. correct? And I think it's more like 400, maybe 450 ish, correct? Yeah. I'm asking Bethany the prices because once they, again. They resell quite heavily considering they don't have well, them. Well, they always sell out. That's Our the thing. Our last trip, they did not have them. No, they sell out. So when they do get them, although it seems really cheap, they have like, because that's kind of wallet. That's like a, a nice wallet. They cost, go for 450 to 500 in, in good use condition. On... Yeah. But the, the, to be fair, like I said, I've used it a few times. There's nothing kind of crazy has happened or everything seems good quality. It's a nice build. Um, what I would say is though, the bottom... Apart from the kind of the leather kind of edging, I guess you'd say, the bottom is totally canvas. And I think if you're kind of person which kind of not throws your stuff around, but kind of isn't a person to put, you'd be careful with it, I guess. Yeah, yeah. This would get dirty. So I would say if you do buy any of these pieces in the kind of supreme canvas, definitely like um, protect them. I know that sounds really anal, but it's kind of one of those things that this, once this is kind of um, dirty, the next stage is to just kind of wear you away. You could it. Uh, what a subspray is called, isn't it? Subspray. I bought this so you could to compare because I'm a Comparison. good little bean. Size wise, they're not they're not, they're not too bad. This, this is, is kind of bigger. Size, this is bigger uh, height wise, I guess, and maybe length. Yeah. But it's probably more narrow. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, this is nylon though, so you could probably stretch it a little bit more. You could kind of stuff, I guess. And once again, this is kind of it's, it's more of a leather belt, so it's kind of more it's restricting, I guess, in a way. Um, I will do a review on the Proud if you want one. Um, but yeah, that was just a quick review on this. Once again, I'd like to do a longer review, but there's nothing else really to, to say. Um, the inside is, as I say, um, how would you style it? One pocket, and that's it. Um, so it depends on the person. Once again, if you can get your crossbody, I think it looks nice. How would you style it? Check my Instagram. Um, no, I, I would wear it. I would wear it kind of to the side, like this, kind of off to the side, maybe. Um, but once again, I, if I'm truthful, I would like to wear it that way. It, it just physically like doesn't fit me that way. It doesn't look like that. No, it doesn't. Um, and that's why I don't wear it that way. Okay. Um, but as I say, I'm broad um, and that just it's just one of those it's one of those things
I think for the for the for what, what we paid, I think it's a really good value bag. I mean, there's not many Gucci bags you can buy from Gucci retail. Just show the dust bag as well because I find that interesting. Because obviously, yep. um, we went into the new dust bag era Full price quite Gucci recently. Dust bag. So yeah, it, uh, for, for overall value, I think is very good. Um, the other thing I was going to mention was obviously with the Supreme print, they have a whole range um, in Bista. I think some of them are um, maybe outlet only, which to be quite frank to me, it's not, it's not a huge issue. Um, but they have uh, a backpack in this, kind of, in, this, in this fabric of this leather. They also have a ladies tote, which is similar to, to, similar to a kind of Louis Vuitton Neverfull kind of size, just a regular tote with leather, leather bound handles. There's a few other bits and pieces. They have like a wash bag, um, but they're all really reasonable. I think they're all well under like kind of six, seven hundred pounds, I think, which once again, I guess, depends what you're looking for, but they're a lot cheaper than it would be in kind of just a normal full price new bag. So if you're looking for gifts, if you're looking for yourself, I think it's definitely worth a, worth a, a go. Do Bista, um, do they, can you make uh, kind of phone call orders? I guess with COVID and everything else, you probably can now. Uh, they weren't doing it. I believe they offer, under the COVID rules, virtual shopping. That was during the second lockdown, though, so I'm not sure if they're continuing that over the normal opening hours because they're busy. Yeah, of course. It's busy. It might be worthwhile checking on that. Um, uh, maybe I'll, I'll pop it in the, um, the, um, the kind of comment section. Because, once again, I know they were doing a lot of these stores were doing virtual shopping, so you can actually go in there and have a look around. Mulberry it is. Okay, cool. But they're they're a quieter boutique. Yeah, it's true. Yeah. Especially on a daily. I suggest you can uh, ring Bista Village and arrange to have a virtual appointment where someone shops for maybe, you. Maybe like an hour before the store. But they probably something. wouldn't be a sales assistant. It would probably be a Bista staff member. They might not have the knowledge. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Either way, give them a call. See what they say. I mean, um, I, I think, like I said, I think they're value for money. I think they're quality. And I'll be honest. Um, the quality is, 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 is regular quality, it's full price, it is nice, it will last. I would just say if you're buying a canvas piece for sure, whether it's to be fair new or old, definitely get that water stopped and, and make sure that you kind of you don't have any issues then going forward. So that's it, quick Gucci review. Um, if you want anything more from us, especially Gucci or anything like that, give, give, us a, give us a comment, let us know. Thumbs up if you want, don't thumbs down, just don't want you to.